And now for a quick look at some other stories from the world of arts and culture. Stay tuned for our News Roundup Shortcuts. Indian-American novelist Akhil Sharma has won the 2016 International Dublin Literary Award for his book Family Life. The award-winning author will receive over $100,000, making Sharma the recipient of the world's highest literary prize for English language novels. Irish writer Lisa McKinney was awarded the prestigious Bailey's Women Prize for Fiction in London on Wednesday for her debut novel, The Glorious Heresies. The $44,000 award is presented each year to the best novel written by a woman from anywhere in the world. Following their closure during Paris's worst floods in decades last week, the Louvre and Orsay Museums have reopened on Wednesday. 35,000 artworks from the Louvre and the famed Impressionist collection at the Orsay Museum were put to safety when the River Seine's levels peaked on Saturday. British singer and songwriter Ed Sheeran could face copyright infringement penalties over his hit song, Photograph. Martin Harrington and Thomas Leonard, who have written songs for Kylie Minogue and Emma Bunton, accuse Sheeran of plagiarizing the music and lyrics of Amazing, a tune interpreted by the 2010 X Factor winner, Matt Cardell. The two authors are asking for $20 million. Spike TV fans have honored actors Ben Affleck and Matt Damon as Guys of the Decade in the 10th Annual Guys' Choice Awards. During their acceptance speech, the pair joked about beating other Hollywood buddies such as George Clooney and Brad Pitt. And we want to recognize some of the other nominees, um, some of the dudes who weren't quite as decade worthy. The 2001 Muhammad Ali biopic Ali will return to US theaters this weekend to celebrate the late boxing legend who passed away last Friday. Michael Mann's film starring Will Smith will play in a few hundred theaters across the United States. Actress and author Teresa Saldana passed away in a Los Angeles hospital on June 6 at the age of 61. Best known for her role in the 1980 movie Raging Bull starring Robert De Niro and Joe Pesci, Saldana gained notoriety as an advocate for victims after surviving a knife attack by a stalker in 1982. A 40-meter-long marbling art piece broke the Guinness World Record in the Czech Republic on Sunday. Nearly 200 marbling artists from 37 countries across the world came together to paint 85 square meters of cloth. The art of marbling was listed on UNESCO's cultural heritage list in 2014.